So first of all, welcome back to this week number 12, day number 24 of the semester. We have two more weeks to go, and the end of the semester comes. And as I shared with you last time, there is no final exam in this class because from the school's point of view, you have to do a learning portfolio. Each one of you in the lab sets equivalent to what we call the final exam. So each one of you must get ready your e learning portfolio using this specific link here in read number uh, 12 or the same link in read number 11 also the same thing in read number 13 14 and 15. now the end of the semester comes if i remember correctly is november the 27th okay but we have one more makeup class day which is the uh, make up the first day's class. So we, the actual end of the semester, the last day we're going to meet is actually on December the first. Okay, December first. If you look at the other environment, we have December the first Tuesday. This time Tuesday. Okay, don't forget it. This is the only day um, in the semester we're going to meet on Tuesday, the last day. Okay. We are going to be right here through, uh, no change in the classroom. In other words, your e portfolio need to get ready before 11.35 on December the 1st, okay? And I will give you a grade immediately after that by looking into the, uh, the e portfolio your grade collected and um, I give you a letter grade, confirm the letter grade. What it means that studying for this week, you will subsequently receive your midterm score, your learning content free score. Okay? And you have to, as I said, make sure if you want to earn the learn to learn score 15 point, make sure you learn to learn activity from the 10 journals and 5 blocks are there in the e portfolio. And if you want to earn the in class participation score, make sure your records of in class participation is also there in your e portfolio. As many records as you can manage, two points each. And remember, as of last week, not last week, as of last class on week number 12, right here, if you look at the public online discussion forum, I've already given you this call for participation in your speech of the semester. If you sign up for this and if you earn the time slot, okay, and hopefully each one of you will do it, you will be given 15 minutes, okay, to make your speech of the semester based on a very simple title, what I learned in this course in the semester, okay, and which is very important and actually it's based on the block you have to write for your learning portfolio. Remember the block you have to write for the refactor block? It's, it's up the same name, what I have learned from this semester. Okay? In other words, you do one thing, but you earn two times the score, and this will give you 10 semester points. So go to this hour. It has the, it could make the difference between the grade. Yes, Kevin. Then 
Delta Is it this one? Mm -hmm. Okay. Because uh, from Kelvin's point of view, he could not see the reply button. Can you check? Do you see the reply button? You can? Okay, let me double check on the configurations of this particular <coughs> Let's see. Before we do It's a standard forward to generate use. Why couldn't it be like Check it one more time, Kelvin. You can do it. Right? Yeah. Okay. Sure. Sure. Yeah. It's a simple mistake in uh, in the configurations. Now you can say it. Okay, uh, so you can start signing up. Any group who's willing to do the presentation today? The learning contract number three. Number three. Are you ready? But Joanna is not here. So Joanna is not here. Yes, it's okay. <laughs> is it okay for your, for your team? Is your team okay? Alright, can you make use of the wiki over there? Take your time, you have 30 minutes, all right? Thank you. Good morning, everyone. And, and today our topic is what is social networking on our team too. And my name is Brandon, and my my team is is and Faith Wolfers and Leo. Thank you. Okay. Yes. And uh, we have four some questions. First one is what are 
advantage of using social networking. Second is what are the disadvantages of using social networking? For third one is who use social networking? For is how to use social networking and what what could what should avoid? Uh, first, firstly, I will talk about the what the advantage of social networking. First one is worldwide collectively collectivity. Well, these are important benefits of using social networking. We can understand what happens in the world every day for using social networking. Also, we can share our daily life. Next page. Uh, second is business benefits. And during the with, during the surface, uh, fifty. 51% um, of market states that social media work, social media marketing has improved their business sales. Using social networking is business can in business can grab the attention of potentials potentials of customers and increase brand visibility. Moreover, it can be much cheaper than traditional advertising and promotional activities. Next. Uh, third is a new stage. Young creators can use the social networking to show their personal styles. They can share their creative ideas and their personal work in short so Possible times in the most efficient way to achieve maximum individual exposure rate. And fourth is collections with people you never would have met in real life. This can be good thing in it does is opens your world to many other few points. A large group of collections always means opportunity for good. Also, it's good for our single guys to meet uh, girlfriends. And uh, that is the end of my part. Thank you, Brandon. Hello, I'm Leo. And my topic, my question is what are the disadvantages of social networking? The first point is face to face connection are endangered. Teens and creatures in this problem, people they could learn to interact with other or build and maintain relationship. If they only use the social networking, they will not learn to interact with other or build and maintain relationship. This is a problem of the team for the teens. The second point is risk of fun or identity firm. Some people can fool a network to steal your personal information. For example, your banking password, phone number, etc. Most researchers need just a few file pieces of personal information to make your life a nightmare. So this is a very important problem. The third point is uh, brilliant. Uh, use for use of social level can expose individual to harassment or inappropriate contact for others. And then in the social levels, children may be exposed to pornography or other inappropriate content. Some people can fool a level to hurt you. The last point is time waste. Social networking can waste a lot of time. People always spend a lot of time for the social networking. But most people are not at work. They spend a lot of time to play games and do and go to Facebook, etc. It could waste a lot of time by the social networking. This is the end of my part. Thank you, Neil. Uh, now we are going to talk who use social networking. Uh, 
Almost every agents are using social networking. There are about 74% internet users are using social networking. Also over 65 years old people have using social networking too. And women are, are use social networking more than men. Um, in this picture, we can see uh, college students are using using the the most social networking. Uh, so, people who have more higher education level using social networking more than lower education level people. Almost teen. Ages using social networking very much. There are uh, some ninety, some ninety-three percent of teen user in internet, and more of them than ever are treating it as a venue of for social interaction. There are 55% of online teenagers have created a profile of the social network. Uh, women prefer to post something on social networking sites and they love to post photos on social networking the most so women use Social networking more than men. Thank you, Rufus. Uh, I want to tell you about how to use social networking and what to avoid. And nowadays, there are more and more people using social networking software. For the reason is that the range of social networking software transfer is larger and larger. Social networking brings us to a fast speed world and it helps us to send and receive something in a, an amazing speed, ignoring the abstraction of distance. Uh, you know, there are more and more software of social networking in our life, like WeChat, QQ, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and so on. Uh, to use the social networking software, the first step to start and the note I want to tell you is that in order to use social networking, we should apply a personal account at first. But remember, if it's not necessary, you are not supposed to fill your personal data for the application. Uh, uh, friends and strangers is, are the most part of your social networking. So you can invite your friends to join you and you can make some people you haven't seen. However, be careful of making strange people and carefully believe, uh, casually believe and send your personal data to them. Share and note, you are share your own idea or problem or just, just your daily life in public. But in some high privacy like Richard, you are supposed to change the organon set that open your related five photos to the stranger into only open to your friends. It can protect your privacy from being used by some craft people. That's all. Okay, Faith, thank you very much. Uh, do you have any conclusions? In, in this learning contest, uh, CO fees, uh, I've learned how to analyze our uh, information and communicate with teammates, define the rest to each other and arrange the times. Mm. Uh, in, in our topics, uh, I've learned in 
uh, I know that in recent years, uh, social level care is practically developing. Also, the foundations of social level care is information technologies. Social level care includes many kinds of knowledge and relative to our life. Um, finally, social level care refers to refer to as a virtual communities or profile sites. Uh, social level care is a website that is a website that brings people together to talk, share ideas and interests, or making or make friends. Thanks. Thank you very much, Brandon, for the conclusions. In learning contract free, I have learned a lot of things and social networking is a public uh, thing in in the world and it has uh, a lot of advantage and disadvantage. Uh, the most important things I have learned is how to work in a team. There are many assignments in learning content free. If I should do them alone, I think I will need more and more time to do the assignments. But we have four members this time. I feel learning content free assignment is more easy than learning content one assignment. So teamwork is important. Thank you, Rufus. <coughs> and in this learning controversy, uh, it, uh, when we start to teach learning controversy, we cannot notice because uh, we have some problem in the PowerPoint. We cannot do the PowerPoint. But we put this courses to know how to do the PowerPoint and then we finish it. In this courses, we learn to what is teamwork because in the learning controversy, teamwork is very important. And we know how to use the wiki to upload something. That's all. Thank you. Thank you, Neil. Uh, about the topic of my partners, uh, what I have learned from this topic is that the technology is full of our life. So it's necessary for us to get used to it. And the most important thing is we should know what will the social networking be benefit or bad for us. And we should know more about it so that we can avoid the pitfall online. That's all. Thank you, Faith. Thank you very much. Your team has done very good work in putting things together. Thank you. May I ask, is there any other team who would like to do the, the presentations today? Now remember, uh, if you want to do the speech of the semester, you need to sign up and you need to get things ready. Okay? And kindly notice that the speech of the semester is actually based on the block of the semester you need to write for your learning portfolio. You understand? 10% of the 20% of the learning portfolio is devoted to your writing of the block called what I have learned from the semester. So it's preferred that you finish writing this first and then you make a speech. All right? The sooner you do it, the better. Okay? Don't miss a chance. Sign first. First in, first serve. One fewer lessons will happen after today and we just have two weeks left. Okay? And we have about 18 students, okay? So you can come back to the discussions on our table. Let me see. Okay, right, you can... If you still have questions about your learning portfolio, make sure you can ask me. But remember, it's very important because it's the preferential of trying to understand it. I need to justify your score with the learning portfolio when you present, okay? It's very important. Now it's a very, very busy period for me, your instructor, because I have to finish grading and give you back the score and then you can put it in the learning portfolio. 
it's a lot of work, okay? But it's fun because you are helping yourself to know your score before the end of the semester. Yes. Remember, learning contract number one, the, the war score is 64 points. For learning contract number three, the war score is 100 points. So if you just add up the score you earn in learning contract number one and also learning contract number three, and divide it by 64 in learning contract number one times 10, you'll, you'll have a score that is expected of you. But remember, the secret is, as I announced last time, uh, I will give a full score to all the students who have never done anything in learning country number one. That's what we call learning curve score. Okay, it's called a crucial score. It's also called an encouragement score. So as long as you've spent time doing learning country number one, you will have 10 final semester points. No matter what the actual number of points you earn, that is for learning country number one. And for learning country number three, which is going to give you 20 semester points, you have to earn the work. Yes, this is how you work in it, and then cut the number one, the score you earn. Although, you will be given 10 points full in any country, but you have to list them out.
the team base with a big swing core character. So some of the something more about the portfolio stuff. Actually, in this week, today, at day number 24, there is many good links here. And one of the links here is it tells you the, the specific things behind portfolio. You don't just build a portfolio for this course. Actually, you build a portfolio for your whole life. Okay, and this is a very good example. You see that the four, the five important competency here. It's a very um, important for each one of you in your college learning. Okay, thank you very much for your participations.